The New York Jets are one of the worst franchises in sports. Their fans have suffered endless heartbreak and humiliation, but for some reason, they just keep showing up and betting on their team. And I'm the guy that takes those bets. Taking bets from Jets fans is soul sucking. I make a lot of money off of them, but I don't feel good about it. It's such a bummer to hear the hope in their voices. They don't even think the Jets are gonna win. They just hope they beat the spread. They never do. I'll have a guy place a bet and ask me straight up, do you think Christian Hackenberg is the future of the franchise? I don't know how to answer that question. It's really sad what these fans have been driven to. Plus I gotta watch all the Jets games. You think I enjoy that? I don't. I bet you thought the butt fumble was pretty funny, right? Well, it's not that funny when it results in 20 different guys named Tony handing you fistfuls of cash while crying. Some of my clients get me so depressed, I make them go to therapy with me. Hey, I don't have a gambling problem. This isn't about gambling. Gambling is fine. We just want you to pick a different football team to be a fan of. Look, I don't need the Jets, okay? I can quit anytime I want. Tony, what do you think of Bryce Petty? He's got a lot of potential, okay? Uh, he can hit those deep targets every time. I've thought about giving it all up and just telling my clients to place their bets with my bookie. I mean, they'll match your deposit up to 100%. Then I can get a happier job repossessing cars. Not all my clients are Jets fans, obviously. Some of them are Mets fans. That's not really better. I know I'm complaining a lot. I just feel so terrible for these fans. At least I don't have it that bad. I'm a 49ers fan, and this year, we're going all the way, baby. Hello? You want to put $50 on the Jets to win more than six games this season? Are you sure? You've been hurt before. Okay, I'll do it. It's Fireman Ed. Ugh.